Hello, welcome to Beth Roars, where we look at your favourite singers to find out what makes them them. Before we start, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. My handle is at Beth Roars and I hold loads of votes on my Instagram so you guys can vote on who I react to. Also, please do check out my website, bethroars.com, where you can book a singing lesson from me. And last but not least, please do head over to my Patreon, which is patreon.com slash bethroars, where you can get more exclusive content, you can get early access to my podcast, and you can also find out a little bit more about my scholarship fund for aspiring artists. We all know Steve Perry and his amazing voice from the band Journey, but they have a new singer, and he is amazing. Oh, that piano part. What a time. It instantly makes me want to cry. Look how open his vowels are. Arnell has an extraordinary story. He's Filipino and, of course, Filipinos are known for being able to sing. However, he had a really difficult start in life. He grew up with his mother and father and his mother really, really got him into music. But by the time he was 13, she had died. And his father was so poor that he ended up living on the streets and had to ration biscuits to be able to eat and survive. And it's just amazing to see how far he's come. At age 15, he became the lead singer of a band and the rest is history. He kept on working. He became really famous in the 1980s in the Philippines and in 2007 is when he got international recognition with Journey. They say that the road and no place to start a family. Oh, he's got soul. Right down the line to spend you me. Love and a music man, it always wanna smoke to be. Oh girl, stay on by me. This just sits in a super high part of the range. And it's so easy for him. What is amazing about him, and his voice is very, very similar to Steve Perry's in that it is just crystal clear, great chord closure, very, very high set. It's very, very easy up here. And this is not easy for most men. And he's got this wonderful, wonderful mix that is just fluid. You can hear it where he, he speaks there. But he's up in his mix. It's higher than where I'm speaking, of course. Circus alive. Lovely easy vibrato. We all need the crowd to make her smile. And forward placement. So you can hear this vibrato, that is a really good sign. Often what people do is they can hit this note, they can't get vibrato on, they haven't got the freedom there yet, but it means it is so controlled when you're just able to sustain and put that vibrato on. Often you can't sustain on these high notes. Oh, he's wicked. Really open vowels as well. The Tagalog, the Filipino language, has lots of open vowels, so it really, really, really helps. And also, the accent as well really, really helps in the placement of singing. So perfect. 
I mean, this is a really good key for me to sing in as a female. It's just so hard to fill Steve Perry's shoes in and they found someone who completely smashed it, which is amazing. He's got the emotion, he's got the technique, it's... I love a song along. It's such, it's such a clever tool. Just having a part of the song that's for the audience to also sing. It makes the audience feel like they are part of the song. So if you're writing a song and you really want to get the audience involved, maybe that's something to think about. One more time! One more time. I would be crying like a baby at that game. That's a dude. So one thing that I always feel about these artists who are just phenomenal, it's like I can give tips and techniques on how they're singing, but you're never going to get like this. One, his voice is just set like that. It's set mega, mega high and he has huge amounts of talent, but also it takes a lot of work. If you want to get there, you have to work so hard and he just has so much stability that, yeah. It's not easy to get a voice like that. I literally have nothing to say apart from like wow. I tell you sang really, really well, thank you. No, oh, you sang really well. Oh jeez. I mean, to me that's just like perfection. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.